you doing? I'm working. You know? The Norwex stuff. How's that going? It's going great. Is it? It is. We got a package in the mail. Um, so, you know how we tend to have problems with Senna's sometimes? You know? Just a little. Yeah. And uh, so this may be an alternative to those. You want me to push this aside and yeah. open it? Yeah, why don't you open that? Let's check them out. Okay, do you have scissors or something? I don't want to break a nail. Sometimes. Oh my god, look at that. You know, the cheap or a cheaper alternative nice. is uh, very warranted. Because not everybody wants to pay what a Senna costs. I will say the packaging is really nice. So these are the Asmax F1, and this is a dual pack. Full disclosure though, these guys did send these to us. Um, they, However, they're not paying us or anything. This is going to be an honest review. Very nice packaging. I'm impressed. It's very. Ooh. The packaging reminds me a lot of the uh, more expensive alternative. But before I open it, look at this. Look how cool this is. It's like iridescent. You see that? I do see it. And here too. I mean, what's so, so say? what's the features here? Quick. Mesh. This says mesh. Um, intelligent voice commands. Ten people mesh with 1.8 kilometer range. Intelligent e n kilometer. En kilometer? Yeah. Sorry, That's kilometer right. range. Intelligent e n c noise reduce. V 5.3 dual chip with octa-core, Asmax world app intelligent ecosystem, lightning bolt is 50 minutes fast charging. That's pretty cool. That'll be nice. And then personalized LED lighting. That's pretty fun, but you know what? I really want to check these out. Check that out. They spent some money on that packaging. <laughs> I love that. That's pretty. So I think that is changing the color of this X. You can change it yeah. to whatever color I you was want. looking into it. It is. It for um, sure is. So for some of us who may have multiple bikes, if you want uh, if you want it to match your bike, or mm -hmm. perhaps you're somebody who has multiple helmets. That is not me. Such as me. Neither one of those um, is me anymore. Not that I have two of them sitting on the kitchen counter at all. All the time. <laughs> and there's a plethora of them downstairs. I guess we should probably put it next to all your Dixons. All right. Scared the dog. Ooh. Those are pretty. That is cool. The packaging is very awesome. I don't. This it's reminds me that. of like outer space stuff, but it is outer space might, stuff. Might kind of grow on me. Not putting them down or anything. Wow, they're they're very light. I am like really shocked. And I believe these are magnetically clipped on. Okay, so we got two of them. So they come in a, a set, I'm assuming? It says dual pack on the box. So you could, can, can you just get one or do you have to get yeah, a dual pack? Yeah, you can pack? get just one. But I think even the dual pack is less than the price of one Senna or one Cardo. So the Asmax F1, I'm looking at it on the Amazon, mm -hmm. is $139. Two fifty nine for the pair. Wow! And the Santa Fifty S, which is comparable to this, does not have a camera. Is at two eighty seven. So, so for less than the price of one Santa, you can have two of these. And that was one Santa. That was on one. Both of those. Wow! Yep. And I will say these are pretty light. <laughs> I'll put those up here. Maybe. Let's see what else is in here. I'm just really shocked with the. I'm impressed. The. Um, the packaging. The packaging is really Very neat. Cool. I love the iridescence. <laughs> I'm all about the packaging. So this must be. So there's two of these boxes in there. So one so must they're be. Probably the these. same. Yep. <gasps> Let's open the other side. <laughs> Maybe I'm, oh, yep, I did it wrong. Ooh, 
Oh, look at your stickers. <gasps> look at the stickers, you guys. <laughs> look how awesome that is. I love the stickers. So it looks like we have stickers, a charging cool. cable, which is USB-C, so it charges just like our phones. 3M tape. That's more 3M tape, and it looks like those are the speakers. speakers. But look on the. This is. I'm not gonna say this for sure, but the competitor comes with pretty much that exact same thing. I think that's the Velcro to put it inside your helmet. So this this is what I want to see. What we put them on, the helmets mm -hmm. with. Mm -hmm. The mounts. Hmm. Oh yeah. So, so this these is actually. Be different. So this is for your microphone, and this is for your speakers. But, but what I'm excited about is I want to see how this. You might works. want to turn that right side up though. That's this? upside down. Yep. There you go. Oh. I'll get it right once in a while or so one time. Just hold it close. Oh my gosh! <laughs> so obviously it's magnetic, you guys. So this would be on the side of your helmet, like this. And then you would put that. Just line it up. And then you hook it in the side. Oh, I felt that pull. I know, right? My hand towards it. But look, it is not coming off at all. That's like genius i love how easy it is to put on because the other one that we have you got to really work with it sometimes it's a pain it is all right put it on <laughs> oh my gosh clip it in push that on that way and push that way on the unit there you go oh okay okay do it again i'm going to install this on my helmet quick and then we're going to check it out but look at this so this okay. is what goes on your helmet. You take this off and you put it on your helmet. And then this slides into here. So there is a sticky mount. I'm trying to say that. Look. 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 Look how cool that Hopefully was. Hopefully that comes back apart. But this yeah, one's yours. Cool. <laughs> 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 but there's also this. Can you open this? Oh, it just slides that's, up that's into to your clip helmet. the helmet, to clip on your helmet. So Instead of doing the tape? Yeah. This is my HJC helmet, but I bought it to see if I like the modular helmet. Now I've got the, the bell. So I'm gonna install this onto here. So this helmet, as you can see, has got speaker cutouts. Um, I never actually take the headliners all the way out because they never go back on the same up here. So I just unpin them and move them forward. So I have the cheek pads out, they're here, and I have all the access to the helmet that I need. So I'm going to put this mount, um, I'm hoping in this area for right now, because if I use this clamp mount, then I can move it wherever I want. Um, but I have my Senna mount here. So I'm just gonna put it right here. Um, and then this simply goes on the side of the helmet like that. It would be better up here probably, but I have a drop down sun visor mechanism here. And as I've learned in the past, those are easily messed up. So then that sits in there like that. This just clips on there like that. Wow. And then when you want to, these will obviously be inside. But then when you want to take it off, you just slide it off. So you have your package with your spacers. These will move the speakers a little bit closer to your ears. And these will go in here. And the speakers will Velcro onto these. Things work great. Always check. There's always a long wire and a short wire. The long wire goes to the other side of the helmet. Short wire goes to the side of the helmet where the unit's on. And this helmet actually has little cutouts. Oh, for the because wire. Speakers are now installed. Now it's as simple as choosing a microphone. And since this is oh, yeah, rubber bands, I mean, it's not a DJI packaging by any means because nobody beats DJI with their packaging. But this is not bad at all. Um, we have the boom microphone. We also have a wired microphone, which is huge. 
which we are not going to use because this is a modular helmet. I'll just put that right there. And the microphone will go kind of in there like that. Microphone. Okay, so on the Senna's, there's like a little arrow. On here there is not, but that is that. We are done with the install, except for putting the helmet back together. It's like so satisfying when you, <laughs> when you pop that back in. I don't even know how to turn this on. You have to charge it first. Hundred percent, right out of the box. Wow! So that's the on button. Those two buttons together. That's volume up. That's volume down. So the only thing we really need to learn is how to hook it up to my phone. You know what I think? What? I think that I should do mine. I think you should do yours too. It's easy, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Looks easy. So um, we're gonna go to the app store. I'm just gonna type in Asmax. See what happens. As Max World. And guys, we didn't use any instructions for this at all. Oh, we're, we're downloaded. Click on the button to connect. Device one connected. Huh. I'm impressed. That's a hundred percent battery. Right out of the box. LED lights on. I gotta make it red. Yeah, red light. You can make it pink. I can change the brightness. Wow. Frequency. I wonder what happens if that burns out. <laughs> I don't know. Let's make it purple. Ooh, no, we can't that's have purple. pink. Not purple. Whatever. It's too purplish. Can't Ooh. have that color. Blue. I think the blue is the brightest. So what if about you the have last one. The first one. First one. That's pretty. So if you have blue, which is bright, this green is bright. That one's kind of toned back. This one also is very toned back, even with the brightness all the way up. Um, so let's just pick a song, huh? What's inside? Super easy. Ooh. Ooh, it's weird not having the dial like we're used to. Mm-hmm. And trying to find the button is just a little bit because you're trying to find Well, it's also back. The up button, which is here. So you gotta tap it. Otherwise if you hold it it goes to the next song. Oh wow. It's so uh, sleek next to your helmet. Yeah. And if it was right, if it was in the correct spot, yeah. I think it would be even more sleek. Yeah. But it's kind of sticking out right now because of where it's, it's right. at. Uh, so the next, uh, we will be riding with these. Um, we'll obviously have to stop and just tell you guys what they're like. Right. Because we can't record our voices or anything with these yet. First thoughts and impressions. It was pretty simple. We'll see when I put mine in. How simple it is okay i'm gonna i'm gonna go out on a limb here and i'm gonna say installation is the same as all of them uh the volume the the power from the speakers is really nice we are going to try them out put them through our paces like i said they sent them to us full disclosure but they're not paying us to do this so this is going to be a real review we're going to tell them what we like what we don't like and we're going to go from there So it's my turn to put the AS Max F1 on my helmet all by myself. Well, with somebody's help sitting off to the side, I think. So I'm getting all of my ducks in a row. And they're so pretty. Look how pretty they are. Very iridescent. I love stickers. All right, got a care bag. Instructions. We did not see the instructions earlier. We have speakers. We got a microphone. So it's just an extra one, I'm assuming. So now I'm gonna open up the clamp that will go on the outside of my helmet. And now I'm going to do the speakers.
I'm going to do that to the other side here. All those just are super easy to put in. I'm just going to slide this into the helmet. Man, that's a tight fit. Look at that. Yay. See, if I can do this, anybody can do it. So then all the wires stick in here and then we put the padding back down over it. So it's magnetic. Look how easy that is. And it's not going anywhere either. I'm super excited to try it out. Okay, I'm gonna turn this on. <laughs> Pause it, delete. Okay, so now I'm gonna turn this on. 80%, I love this. Oh, there it goes. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Goodbye. Bye. I have all mine set up, just like Stevie has all of his set up, and now we're going to go test them out on the road. Okay, so we got our new intercoms on, the AS Max F1, and Stevie's got hers on. And to put these to the, to the test, right, we want to put them in the worst environment possible. That's right, folks. The award-winning... 2018 Road King Classic with the Tab Performance 50 Cals with the Zombie Baffles. Award winning. Let's hit it. We're going to run to town and get something to eat. Um, obviously, we won't be able to talk to you guys with these um, because we don't have uh, microphones or anything hooked up in our helmets. But uh, we'll be able to tell you all about it. I'm going to say the number one thing the speakers are amazing they are better than my Senna speakers while listening to music however the microphones not so much it won't stay it keeps it won't stay in front of my mouth you're it does delay that. It. you're in a delay now you are we've always had that delay no I didn't think so yeah. See, that sounds great right there. Right there. Sounds great. Right there? Yeah. Right here probably sounds pretty good, but it won't stay there. It like it straightens itself back out. It's not like a setting where you can bend it and it stays there. But the speakers, primo. If I'm going to go by myself and just listen to music, this is what I'm taking because the music sounds amazing. But it's also when you're listening to music and you're talking to somebody else, it doesn't die down until or turn down the music until they start talking. So that's nice too. Yeah, uh, what she said. Yeah, that's pretty cool too. So like when I'm talking to Amy, my music doesn't turn down while I'm talking, but it does turn down when she starts talking back to me. So that's pretty cool, but. Um, big red sports bar, we're gonna run and grab something to eat. Okay, so the AS Max, F1 intercoms speakers are absolutely amazing. I can hear my music phenomenally. Even riding the winner of the muffler shootout, I can still hear my music. The only problem is the microphone, you can kind of get it to bend where you need it, but what are you? Sorry. <laughs> what are you... <laughs> Being your Vanna. Um, but the microphone's not the best. So it's, it's a really tinny sound, I guess, but um, and we'll get Miss Stevie's comments here in just a second. But I think that if you're going to buy a comms unit and not and not use it all the time, I mean, like I said, the price of two of these is the same price as a Senna 50, uh, 50S. Um, $259 for two of them, $139 for one of them. That's cheap for an intercom system that has mesh that connects automatically just like the Senna's mesh does but this system is cool what do you think <laughs> i think i feel like i'm in a tin can when i'm talking to you but i can hear my music perfectly and when when i'm talking to you then which that's me not you guys <laughs> when i'm talking to stevie as my music is playing it doesn't die down until, or it doesn't 
What do you want to call it? It doesn't get quiet. Get quiet until he starts answering me or talking to me back, talking back to me. And then the music quiets down so you can hear me better. Right. But, but still, if I'm talking, it doesn't quiet down. Yeah. I like it. I honestly think that even when the music's on, you almost have to shut it off to really understand what she's saying. And when she talks, if we haven't talked for a while, I get like the back half of her sentence instead of the whole sentence. So it takes a second for it to cover up. So you almost have to go, um, and then start talking. <laughs> I remember that. <laughs> <laughs> if I hear the um, it's going to get annoying though. But I mean, for a, a budget system like this, which is what I'm going to call it. Those are not gunshots. That's fireworks. I'm going to call it a budget system. It's phenomenal. It's absolutely. We had cheap systems before we switched to Senna's. Wow. They were horrible. These are absolutely phenomenal. And you can change the colors too. I don't know if we told that. Um. So yeah, AS Max, pick up your guys's uh, on Amazon. They're on Amazon. And AS Max so, I mean, F1. But uh, I mean, will this replace my Senna? Probably not. Will I leave it on this helmet? Absolutely. Because I use this helmet quite a bit, like when I'm going places by myself. I'm so, excited to hear if this connects to the Senna's. It's supposed to. I'm excited to, to test that out. All right, so as you can see behind Miss Stevie, we have a sticker door, sticker cabinet. Uh, if we're fond of the product, we put it up on the up on the wall. So Miss Stevie, does it make the sticker door? Yes. Pairing with the Senna is a little tough. We haven't quite gotten that part yet, but so as we said, they did send us these for free to try them out and use them, um, but they're not paying us. So we get to say whatever we want about them. There are some things we like, there's some things we don't like, but on a budget, I mean, if you're just not gonna use them all the time, or even if you are gonna use them all the time, uh, if you wanna start out with something cheaper, they're great for that. On a scale of 1 to 10, they win. So everybody, if you like this video, hit the like button. If you want to see more stuff like this, subscribe. Hit the bell notification so you know when we load up next. And until next time, everybody stay cool, and we will see you on the road.